Welcome to One Pink One Plants. Today I would like to talk about Glass House Works Greenhouse, which is located in Ohio. This greenhouse is only taking online orders at the moment, and they have both traditional and unusual plants. This greenhouse also propagates per order, which can lead to wait times. For example, my order was placed on October 26, 2020, and I didn't receive my plants until about a month later. And that was okay with me, I didn't mind waiting. I just wanted to do this video because I wanted to do a review on this nursery. They have reasonable prices and they ship their plants very well. They are covered in shredded newspaper and then wrapped in sheets of newspaper and the plants come very healthy looking and um, pretty big for the most part i was surprised okay let's get into my plants so the first plant i would like to show you it's called the philodendron scanton oxycardium and that's just your common philodendron this is the philodendron scantons i received as you can see it's made well it's a plant for hanging baskets and it's very common and it grows very well next on the list we have the philodendron lucans. This is a beautiful plant. It has heart shaped leaves, but it's um, sort of velvety, so the leaves are in heart shapes with velvety, velvety looking. I just think this is gorgeous. Um, this plant came in kind of like, okay, this plant came in damaged a little bit, but it's growing well and it's growing a lot of new leaves and I'm just very happy. Next, we have the Philodendron Scandens Mediopictum. And that's just the philodendron Brazil. As you can see here. It's a beautiful heart-shaped leaves. It has a creamy lime central, um, sometimes with gray green feathering it's when I received it it was about two times the size of this plant and I couldn't help it now I already have more cuttings going okay. next we have the Hoya Carnosa Crimson Queen This is the Hoya Carnosa Crimson Queen. With this plant, you can see that it has white edges around the leaves. And when it grows, it will have leaves, new leaves that will come out slightly pink mine was shipped um, as a plant rooted okay 
Okay, next we have the Hoya Carnosa Crimson Princess. This little guy right here, our little one here. And this one, it was also shipped as a plant, bare root. And this one creates a pink blossom when it blooms. And the leaves have a lime, uh, have a golden lime center. The leaves have a golden lime center and they can also be slightly pink when they emerge. Unlike the Crimson Princess, the Queen has the white color on the outer parts of the leaf and the, the princess has the white parts in the center of the leaves and that's how you can tell the difference between the two Okay. Moving on. I also received a Sabrina Pendula Discolor Multicolor. And I think this one's very pretty. I really didn't know what to expect because online the pictures don't show the the actual plant most of the times they just show a leaf or the top of the plant yeah. and that's also why I wanted to make this video just to help you out and give you an idea of what um, type of plant or cutting whether it's a cutting or an actual bare root plant that you will be receiving i also received a philodendron scandens arium and that's this plant right here it's beautiful this one is known as the lime leaf vine it's also heart shape but the leaves come more of a yellowish um, leaf looking I'm trying to focus on the leaf so I hope you can see it and it came really long as well like it was a really long cutting and I already did some more cuttings <laughs> as you can see I love my plants but I really want to make full baskets of them so I'm just cutting them and rooting them and hopefully I'll have a full basket okay up next I have the tread Try this Cantia Blush Made Bride. It looks very pretty in person. And when it came to me, it had a lot more pinkish color. And um, I didn't really notice that this plant likes the cold. And I had it in a warmer area and it turned green. It reverted to green, the green color. So then I read that it likes the cold. So I moved it 
to the cold area and it, lo it looks very healthy now and it's showing a lot of purple on the bottom of the leaves and the pink is coming out again so this plant is very interesting this plant gets pink when it's cold <laughs> that's cute I have a Hoya compacta here and this is the Hoya I received it was rooted and this is the size I received now I also received a gift from the nursery this plant right here so this plant is also known as the baby waffle it has purple grape sized leaves and it's commonly used in terrariums It does grow slowly and that's okay. It's beautiful. Apparently the leaves will also show some purple on the top. So far we have covered plants that came bare root and Next, I will show you a plant that came as a cutting. So this is the Monstera oblica. Um, this one came as a cutting and I propagated or I rooted it in water. And once I got a small size root about an inch I transfer it to a pot and I just checked it um, I actually dropped it in it. and I checked it and it has a very very long root that has attached to the bottom of the pot um, which is a good thing <laughs> and I'm very happy with this one it's beautiful it came about two to three times its size and Again, I couldn't help it and I did some cuttings. Okay, so another cutting I received from this nursery. It's the Peperomia Acuminata Varigata. As you can see the variegated leaves are beautiful um, this one this one was a cutting I rooted it in water the last plant I would like to show you is known as the Hoya pink silver this is the cutting I received I think this is a pretty old cutting um, from an older plant it's supposed to look a little more green and with the white splash on it well that's it for today just to recap I really like this nursery because it has reasonable prices the plants are packed and shipped well I also consider the plants and cuttings to be really a really good size. Overall, I love my plants and I can see myself ordering other plants in the future. Thank you and don't forget to subscribe or hit that like button. Have a good day!